Hey there and welcome to No Rice Brew Required. I'm Dave and tonight I'm going to show you how to do one of my favorites, Alfredo sauce. Now it's that nice creamy sauce with um, obviously cream, a little bit of Parmesan cheese, flavored with black pepper. That's kind of one of, the main, uh, one of the main ingredients in there. A lot of times a little bit of parsley. Super easy to make, obviously awesome for like a fettuccine Alfredo, but it's great for, uh, you know, as a sauce for chicken or for vegetables, for all kinds of things. Let's go ahead and get to it. Okay, let's go ahead and make a quick Alfredo sauce. Now, uh, mine is super easy. You can get more complex. A lot of people add garlic, a lot of people add other stuff. I keep mine super, super simple. A little bit of heavy whipping cream in a, uh, in a saute pan. I'm gonna bring this up to a simmer and just start to reduce it um, very, very carefully. You don't wanna boil it, you just want kinda light simmer and uh, I'm going to let it reduce by about a quarter. Okay, so as our cream reduces, you're going to notice that the uh, bubbles on top get a little bit smaller, which uh, is what you should expect, which is normal. You may also want to take a spatula and just kind of scrape down the sides every once in a while because the, um, the cream that kind of sticks to the sides can actually brown a little bit and you're not looking for that. So after we get it reduced, I'm going to add our fresh cracked black pepper. A good amount, yeah, it's maybe a quarter to half a teaspoon. And then I'm also going to stir in the Parmesan cheese. Now I'm using maybe, you know, a third of a cup of finely grated Parmesan. And that's just going to kind of melt in. And we're going to turn our heat down a little bit more. You can see that thickens the sauce a little bit. And it's just going to continue to thicken and get a little bit more sauce consistency over the next you know, five or so minutes. You can really just kind of let it go. Um, again, slowly simmering till it gets the, uh, the desired thickness. If you ever need to thin it out a little bit, just add a little bit more cream. You can even add a little bit of water. So I'm gonna let this go just maybe another minute to get it the consistency I'm looking for. Okay, so to finish up our Alfredo sauce, I've got it down to the, um, the consistency I want it. I'm gonna add, I like to finish mine with a little pinch of freshly chopped parsley. Stir that in, and like I said, anytime you need to, you can just add a little bit more cream to thin it out. We'll give it a taste, and we'll discover now we never put salt in there, which is why we taste. So I'm gonna throw a little bit more salt in there, a little bit more salt, a little bit of salt. I'm gonna add in a little bit more pepper, stir this up, and we are good to go. That is how I make a simple and delicious Alfredo sauce. I'll see you next time on No Recipe Required. Mm -hmm.